Okay, another weekend, another build. Um, today, planning on building up this Steve Guff build, um, this Reynolds 631 frame and fork. Got the fork here, um, and it's going to be a new road bike for me. Uh, I've got my Shimano 600, 6400 variety um, to go on uh, with the brifters as well, so it's all got the complete set. I haven't built the wheels up yet, I have got some uh, Alex Rims wheels to go on, some new ones. Um, but yeah, it should be a nice pink frame, pink build in this harsh winter's light. And I literally don't believe this, but the battery is already flagging up low and it's the battery must be terrible now, must be dead. Anyway. It's a 653, 631, I need to get this right, 631 frame and forks, butted, lugged, it's a custom build by Steve Guff, um, who's a UK field frame builder, and it's a really nice light frame. It does have, if I scroll up, there we go, internal routing on the top tube, which is going to be interesting, I've never routed anything internal before. Um, and I'm going to go for black components as I ran an Instagram poll to uh, decide either black or silver. So we've got black seat post, saddle, a headset, bar, stem, um, and the wheels are black as well to go with the silver Shimano 600 components. Um, but yeah, I think it will look good. I'm going to try and get as much as I can built right now before the battery runs out and then we'll uh, see where we can go.
Ich habe Angst, aber ich denke. And there we go, one new roadie for me. Um, yeah, before anyone before anyone mentions it, the hoods. The hoods are a state. They're original 90s hoods in white that I've used for thousands of miles and uh, they're falling apart and they're dirty. Don't worry about that. I've got some new ones on order. Well, not new ones. I've had to buy another set of shifters, but they're on order with black hoods. Um, here comes Torvi. Come on, miss, out the garage. That's it, go and have a look at the bike. Up a bit. Go on, to, no, okay. Not interested. What do you think? <laughs> You're just gonna start, just gonna start, okay, go and see me. Hey. Okay, so yeah, anyway, back to the hoods. The hoods are on order, um, as are a, another set of used shifters. They are used hoods, so I will replace them when they come, and then I'll have black hoods on. Um, it's impossible to find brand new ST6400 hoods. It's just impossible. They're, um, they're not something you can come across. If you do, let me know. Um, but yeah, there you go, it's all come together pretty nicely. Um, the only things, the only niggle that I've found is I need to change the limit screw, the high limit screw on the rear derailleur, that is rounded, but I can still get it out at least, so I can change that. And the front shifter won't shift, so luckily with this other shifter coming, uh, I'll be able to have a spare, replace it if I need to, it shouldn't be too hard to replace it. But the pink the skin walls, the black, everything looks great on it. Everything looks great. I'm really happy with how it's come out. Um, and I should be able to get back on the road and get my fitness up. So just going through the parts, up top we've got the ST6400 2 by 8 shifters. As I said, the hoods are being replaced and the resin domes are coming. Deed bar tape with some ITM Super Europa handlebars and a Calloy stem. Uh, just in the background there, you've got a new Tange headset to go with it. Down at the brakes end, we've got the BR6403 calipers, uh, dual pivot. So you've got a pivot there and the pivot there. Uh, Clark's triple compound pads, I find they work pretty well, for uh, very well for how cheap they are. Uh, some Alex rims, wheel set, thanks noisy car. It's a Fiesta, of course it's a Fiesta. Alex rims wheel set wrapped in some Panarasa Pasea 700x25C tyres. Now obviously the frame set, frame set is an air hardened butted Reynolds 631 frame set custom built by Steve Goth had that internal routing on the top tube which tucks it away nicely and it's actually must have the guide all the way through because it popped out really easy down at the bottom end fitted a Tange bottom bracket I think that was 113 mil with a 60 uh, with an FC6400 crankset. At the moment I've got the PD 
6400 pedals on but I've also got a set of the um, what do you call them SPD style Shimano 600 wand as well and I've got a modern set which I need to find because I want to put those on but these are just on for decoration at the moment um, and it's got a P, uh, F FD 6401 front derailleur that's braze on they come in both braze on and clamp on and finally at the rear we've got the RD 6401 Shimano 600 tricolor obviously um, and that's combined with a SRAM PC830 chain with a PG830 cassette which I believe is like a 12 to 23 so it's quite close ratios on the rear Okay, so there we go. That's a uh, build up, up too close, and walk round of the new roadie. Um, hope you like it. I like it. I like. I want to get out and ride it now. But unfortunately, the time is currently 20 to 11 on the Sunday. Normally, the video is meant to release at 12. So I've got to quickly get this edited um, and somehow get it uploaded quickly but yeah hope you enjoyed this little video it's just a quick one just building up this road bike it's simple no restoration style um, 6400 is my favorite group to use on a roadie and this has come together really well with the black so uh, like subscribe comment and all that sort of stuff and I'll hopefully take you out on a ride on it um, very soon